Booyakasha! I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. We are gonna look at a 2021 Highland Ridge Open Range, the high-end version, fiberglass skin, front fiberglass cap, four slides, weighs around 10,700 pounds. We got an outside kitchen, we got electric jacks. I said four slides, there's a bunk room in the back that's fantastic. Brandon's a big fan. Let's say hello to Brandon. Hey everyone, if you like the video, please like and subscribe. Fantastic, right here at the front, front power jack, 30 pound per paint tanks, beautiful molded front fiberglass, nice lights through here. I can see myself in the painted portion. Brandon likes the pony, right on. That's very nice looking there at the front. We've got ourselves, uh, not really a passer storage, but a storage that goes about three quarters of the way through there. We have access to that for our laundry chute inside. We have our uh, battery disconnect there. There are lights, like I said, in that front cap. You turn those on and off from there. And then we have electric jacks with JT strong arms built in. So it's gonna be super secure for you. And then we got some more storage here in our bed slide. All right, pop that up. Underneath here, you know, great storage. We got aluminum framing, which you can see proof of. Slam latch doors. We got our uh, six gallon gas electric water heater, sewer drain down here, furnace vent kitchen slide with our fridge in it. I didn't mention slide toppers, Brandon. We got four slide toppers on our four slides. And then our tires are dirty, but still looking good with the aluminum, uh, aluminum rims there. 16 inch tires, nitro fill. What kind of suspension we got there, buddy? That's the, uh, the lipper, like trailer kind of suspension. Secondary sewer drain here at the back for our secondary washroom. Here's our bunk room slide, pulling that off the floor. We're gonna light that bunk room shortly here. 50 amp service, roof ladder. Get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. Fantastic. Nice rack here. We can store something here. We can store our bikes. We have our uh, kind of convenience center here at the back as well. City water connection, freshwater fill, black water flush kits, outside shower, cable satellite inlet, outside receptacle, nicely sealed off the side of the trailer here. Uh, LED lights outside and inside. Have a look at this kitchen. This is a killer kitchen. So lots of storage through here. We can do what we want there. We got our three cubic foot electric fridge. We got a cutting board where we can cut up our vegetables, hopefully not our fingers. And then we got uh, a storage drawer underneath. And then this folds over, I think to be a utensil kind of carrier, eh Brent? Is that what we decided? Makes sense, yeah. Yeah, I like that, fantastic. And then we got our uh, suburban uh, griddle right through here. So we're cooking right on this service surf surface. And then we got our uh, countertop itself. It's not like a like a countertop. It's steel, so it's not going to corrode on you. And then you got a sink there that's plumbed in to the uh, gray water. Um, here on the side, we got our. We mentioned slide toppers, but we also have a slide. Uh, sorry, an awning off the slide as well. So that starts right here. Ends right here. Oh, nice speakers here, Ben. Yeah. Fantastic. Lower speakers. That's nice to see. And then we got our main awning starting there covering the front portion of the trailer. We get a four step entrance, right nice and secure to the ground. Lend a hand grab handle. Oh, what did I say for weight? 10,638, this particular one weighs. Outside TV hook up here, and then just really good looking from the outside. Nice frameless windows, beautiful colors. It's a great trailer. Let's have a look inside. Right on folks, we're inside that open range uh, 338BHS. You've just uh, basically walked in the trailer, you're looking forward here. One of the huge features on this guy is this awesome front king bedroom. We have a slide here pulling that king bed off the floor. We got uh, bedside tables, a couple windows on either side too. But pulling up that off the floor, it gives us this wicked front closet as well. So we can hang up all our clothes, goes all the way back there. We have a nice laundry chute. We have access to that pastor storage at the front. And then we got all this storage here. So, uh, shelf, shelf, spot to hang stuff, our washer dryer prep is in through here, and then they gave us a additional barbecue as an option, which you can hook up right near that outside kitchen. Right here is our like dresser basically, so counter space, drawer down below. Okay. And then we do have a second AC, a second quiet cool AC here in the bedroom as well. We can control that from the thermostat. Into our bathrooms, our main bathroom, porcelain toilet, of course. Squat check checks out. Storage there. Medicine cabinet above. Linen closet in through here. 
Very nice and solid, very nice and bright in through here. I like when these shower doors are clear. It makes the whole bathroom feel huge. Up in the shower, I'm six feet tall. This is such a big trailer that it doesn't, you know, there's no height restriction here at all. Brandon can shower in through here, easy peasy. Now, coming out of the washroom, into our living space. I don't want to miss this, Brandon. Check this out. Okay, all our controls, a spot to hang up our jackets, that kind of stuff, right as we walk in the door. Our living space, though, is awesome. We got two slides through here um, with an island kitchen. We have a gas electric 12 cubic foot fridge. All right. Um, we have our nice three burner stove top. Okay. Deeper oven than standard. Oven drawer. Okay. Look at this. I love that. That's fantastic. Store your spices, whatever you want in through there. Of course, this is all solid surface. We have a nice microwave here. Store, store there. <clears throat> Our island itself has a stainless steel sink that's undermount. We got some fancy drawers. Look at that, little skinny drawers through here beside the beside the uh, the, the sink. Some cupboard space, and then our standard drawers are right through here. Okay. Further to our hutch, more counter space, nice backsplash through here. Four more drawers here. Bunch of storage here above the hutch. Okay, and where's our receptacles? They must be, yeah, we got two individual receptacles right here for our hutch area. And then, you know, our main slide for the trailer is on the door side, which, you know, does eat up into the uh, the awning space, but it doesn't matter because we have that second awning off of here. But look at this, look at all the windows facing our site, facing our campsite, fantastic. We got this really cool dinette set up. So we have two chairs that are folding underneath the bed right now, so that's where they are. Uh, and you have these standard chairs, but they're not so standard, right? They they got this pull-out piece here that you can basically turn into a bench. All right, so oh Josh, there we go. That's like standard right there. Pull this up, pop this down, turns into a bench. You got two people sitting here, and then you have two more people sitting at those two folding chairs, which is nice. The inner seats are right here. Um, they are heat and massage, manual reclining action, storage here across the top storage across the top of the dinette as well and then these seats are facing our fireplace graystone fireplace beautiful big tv right here i can see that it's perfectly head-on um awesome now this bunk room is fantastic it's is it, is it your favorite bunk room brennan i think so especially with the bathroom and a travel trailer nothing like it no no lots of space in through here we got our booth dinette kids can color back here they can eat their their wheaties all right Window through there. This is gonna pop down, give us another big bed. All right, the depth here is pretty fantastic. We haven't talked about dual pane windows. We had dual pane windows on this one, Brandon, and a backup camera. Um, spot here, mount the TV for the kids. All this netting here, we can store some stuff. We got a couch. All right, we're able to relax back here, hang out. I can pull these chairs, these uh, cushions off, sleep another person. Built in ladder to this big double bunk above here. It's not really a double but definitely a wide single, another window through there, vent. And then, I don't wanna miss this, check out the storage here as you walk in the room. Spot to hang coats, store stuff up here, and then three drawers here down below. And then into our second washer. Big drawer there. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Wow, that's a huge drawer. <clears throat> Lick. Okay, into our second washroom. Even our second washroom is a porcelain toilet. Storage there. I love it. That's nice. Look at the attention to detail. They finished that off really well, and the door just fits right beside it. Sink, medicine cabinet with another vent in through here. Right on. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, share that with your friends, and then you can email us at sales at lazyacres.com or you can call us at 705-833-2539. Have a good day.